Welcome back to my Let's Play for another Morona. I suppose it's time to head to the, um, Icicle Wasteland, basically. Because let's face it, it's just full of ice. If it wasn't for all the snow, I think this place was a desert. Though I suppose it could be, you know, not receive a lot of, um, rain or snow. So I have to ask how weather works around here, because, you know, it doesn't seem like the Fire Island's that far away. Like... Is it like one piece where islands have like weird weather patterns? You know, you go from like a summer island to a spring island to a winter island or summer to winter, you know, like just bam, back to back because the weather patterns are just all crazy. Ooh, I didn't expect it to be this cold. Yeah, I'm kind of curious how Corona puts up with it. I mean, she's effectively just walking around in underwear how in a cape. I hope you didn't catch a cold. Ugh. You don't get colds because you're cold. He's so overprotective. That's why I don't want to be part of this group. Seriously, that's why? Is it because it reminds you of yourself? Because you're quite the overprotective big, big brother. Despite, you know, being a massive dick that screws other people out of their work. I'm sorry. I'm going to do my best. Hey, us phantoms don't feel the cold, but Morona has a body. For now. It's fine, Ash. I can take care of myself. Good. The other possessed looks fine. Yeah, I'm kind of curious how she's holding up so well. Does she, like, have a warming spell and you know, sewn to that cloak or something? I can't believe this kid's a chroma. Stay out of our way. I'm sorry. Are you going to steal Morona's job here too, Mr. Walnut? Jeez. <laughs> so we're acquainted over there too, huh? Probably. Yes, through Oxide. Ah, uh, yes, where, where a guy steals another Chroma's work. A massive asshole, that's what. They steal jobs from us chromas. They're like hyenas. I compare them more to vultures myself, because hyenas at least have an impressive bite, because they can bite through, like, bone. <laughs> the chromas fault for not being more careful. You're right, we should be more careful. Let's kick him in the balls a few times. <laughs> He's right. I wasn't careful enough. Guess you didn't stomp hard enough, right? Looks like Corona went through a lot in her world. Yeah, because she probably didn't exist in it. You're right. But she looks like she's having fun. Fun, huh? <laughs> I remember now. I was in danger like this because of you. Eh, that doesn't seem that threatening. Now you understand what it feels like. <laughs> You can't hold me responsible for my other self. What the hell did I do? A lot. Fire of battle. Reveal my heart. Psycho Burgundy! And yet, we don't actually have him, you know, available because we put him in storage. Because, you know, screw him. Now, let's see. Who do I want to summon? Well, we'll bring out Ash. Yeah, I've really jacked up the power of his weapon, so it's quite impressive at this point. I guess we'll bring out someone else. Um, yeah, we'll bring out her. Sad part is, Morona's getting made more and more useless because, you know, the enemies hit harder and the only thing she can do is, you know, do some summons early on. That's about it. Yeah, I know, Sprout's getting over-leveled, but... Under leveled, sorry, but I only need like three people to start doing um fiery path after a while or whatever it was called. Um, let's see, are you weak to Gale? Well, he's not weak to it, but let's face it, with my enhanced power and no resistance, I can probably just smash him. And begin making our way out towards the middle. Okay, do I have? I don't have enough points for that. Damn. 
I can fire slash though. Fire resist, fire resist. Neutral, can I get over here? I would rather use a uh, Berserker though, because let's face it, it doesn't have, you know, the resistance aspect added into it, so I can just, you know, hopefully get two of them caught up. There we go. And move them over and kill them both. Sweet. Damn, that ice is slippery. Okay, let's move over here and smash you. Um, Berserker. Ironically, um, she's got heal up there, but do I want to go after this guy? I can't reach. Darn it. Um, okay, we'll go after you then. We'll send you flying, and I guess that's gonna basically do it for us. I don't have enough room left. I suppose I can hopefully position myself for a Gale Slash later. Sprout's so slow, he's useless now. Darn. Okay, can I hit this thing with a Gale Slash? Like, even if, you know, it can somewhat resist, I don't care. Yeah. 40% resistance, so, you know, it might be, um... No, I thought I actually survived with, like, two hit points left or something, but... Apparently it's gonna get denied, okay. Can I get... Oh, can I just run right up there? No, apparently not. Okay, so I'm gonna have to use this. Let's hit him with a Truth Lasher then. Because that doesn't require me to throw away my weapon. Unlike some other maneuvers I could think of. Because there are a few attacks I know that require me to throw the weapon long range, and that's just a bad idea. Well, if nothing else, I'll get points for breaking that stuff, I guess. Oh yeah, I guess I could have used the slippery um, nature of the ice to help out there. I wonder if the mermaid's gonna finally come down then. I guess it doesn't matter, the fight's already over. Okay, let's blow you out. I guess the body um, hit out of bounds. I think we broke the pot, though. Okay. Yeah, I kind of got rid of all my stuff. Though I still just want the dungeon monk, darn it. After all, if I had that, I can work on, you know, opening up a whole new level of broken. And I'd love to do that. I really would. Icicle Island. I became an oxide for the first time here. Who's your rip off? Was it Walnut? Then I approve. What? I can't believe you'd ever become an oxide. How many insulting bottle mails have you received? Um, none, because Ash keeps them away from Morona. Because he knows how um, mentally scarring they can be. Told Morona about those. And it was probably for the best, because we can see how she turned out. Oh, I see. What's the matter, Ash? Oh, nothing. Morona, <laughs> you're so lucky. What? Compared to you. You're what? I've received horrible bottle mails because I'm a possessed. I stopped getting job offers, so I had to become an oxide to survive. Hmm. Corona. What the hell am I doing in that other world? Nothing, because you're probably dead. Like, for reals. You have the same eyes as me. Oh, is that what he meant earlier? How funny. You just scolded me, but you're an oxide too. <laughs> I only took jobs from horrible people like you. But there were no more good people. Everyone was into lying. 
like you. Great. <laughs> are you trying to get back at me? Humans are intriguing. Uh, that's a weird comment. I mean, I know he's technically a phantom now, but he was a human at one point, so... Why the weird contrary implies you aren't human? They're the same, but one's a chroma and the other's an oxide. But it's everyone else's fault. Fine. I accept your challenge. Hmm. Looks like Corona had it worse than us. Yeah. Morona and Corona. They're the same, but totally different. Yeah, we noticed. <sighs> I need to get Morona a better weapon. Different? The truth is... The truth is, we're in trouble. Because this stage is probably going to be a pain in my butt. Because we're locked in battle with a fungi. Ugh. And that thing's cut off. Okay, I can't do anything about that. And it comes with sticky. Um, let's see. HP heal 20%. Okay, can fine. Flame, I need you to do some heavy lifting over there for me. Um, reinforce 20%. Okay, we'll use that on Sprout. He probably doesn't strictly need it, but, you know, I'll still do it anyway. Um, can I reach this fake stump? Um, continue to move forward. Yep, it's within the range now. Okay, we'll summon out Ash. And we'll put Raphael over here. And, you know, we're probably going to get completely messed up by that fungi when it comes after us. But there's not much I can do about that right now besides end turn. And let these guys do their job. This thing weak to wind. That's it. Good. Maybe I can kill it before it takes me out. There. Die, damn you. Of course, I'll probably still get in trouble later anyway. Okay, let's cobalt blue you. Oh, I'm sorry, no, couple just burst. Boom, body out, but no one cares about the body because it's already dead. Okay, can I get two for one here? With fire slash, maybe, but I'm gonna have to see the resistance is 30, 30, and his weapon's not as strong as broken as some of the others, so that's not pro not something I'd favor. Um. Darn, that's not going to help at all. Okay. We'll just bring the sword town on you then. Um, let's position knock this guy flying. Yep, just die, Titleist. Um, continue the burst um, spree, right? Left the sword behind, cool. I don't particularly want the sword, though. Um, yeah, we'll just knock you back. And um, we'll continue our attack. Ah, uh, we couldn't hit both. Well, they're positioned in opposite directions. Yeah. Okay, we're almost done here. Saying so much time leveling up means I guess I'm kind of OP at the moment. Ah, going after Sprout, huh? Well, he is the weaker of the two. And you did manage to loosen up his weapon. And you might have a chance to steal it before he gets a chance to actually do anything about it. Okay, we're only hitting that guy. Let's just fling him then. One more turn. I guess we can try confining into some other stuff now. And try and steal it, right? Let's go. Um, let's see. Has this thing got a lot of mana on it? Not particularly, but I guess enough to make it work make it worthwhile. 
If I can get a high steel chance on it. Um, I guess I can go for 51%. What about this rock? Um... Move. Um, continue to confine, I guess. A rotten old tree. Well, we'll put her there. We'll try and steal this so so spell book, but you know, my chances of getting it aren't particularly high. And we got a desired seed, huh? I've already summoned as many phantoms as possible. Okay. Well, oh, yeah, try and take Sprite out now that he's got no weapon. It's not a terrible plan, I suppose. It's not a very good one. Okay. Well, none of that's my stuff, so, you know, just send it flying. How did you survive that, man? And action, you, um, go lift up your weapon, will ya? At least I hope I can lift this up. <sighs> Sometimes, you know, I go for those lifts and I won't have enough time left. You must have had a decently leveled up weapon to have survived, um, Ash's hit, to be honest. Oh, I didn't get luck with stealing stuff. Darn. That night... Marona took Ash out to have a talk. She wanted to ask him a question. A question best not asked? Ash, are you hiding something from me? He's hiding a lot of things from you. What? How could I hide anything from you? Well, because you checked the ball mails first, that's how. You know, huh? You just got rid of the bad bottle mails, so I wouldn't get hurt. Morona. It's probably for the best, because we saw how Corona turned out. Am I that weak? Mr. Walnut said I was also. You're doing a great job. I think you worked too hard, actually. But Corona's working so much harder. She appreciates you, too. Well, let's face it. Ash does have probably one of the more OP, um, end abilities besides blowing himself up when he departs. That doesn't even actually hurt the character doing it. You know, they have, like, a departing bomb gift. Problem is, it means if you're near allies when you go off, you can potentially kill them as well. So, it's a mixed blessing. It's, like, based on your HP stat. But it can be useful for um, leveling on certain stages. I'll be, usually want the one that blows up when you come in for that trick, which I've shown off in a video before. She's only a year older than me, but she doesn't need her ash. I don't think she has an ash. Will I ever be like her? Who knows? Oh, so you're saying that I won't? But we should be more alike. It's probably best that you're not alike, to be honest. Well, I don't know about that. We have the same power, and we're both called the possessed. Morona. I wonder if she'll be my first friend. That would be pretty weird, wouldn't it? Though I suppose it worked for the two Xenos. <laughs> Well, I guess that means there's still one more stage to go through. Oh, I can make Mystics now? Archers at least get quick attack. Problem is, I don't really have anything that would favor them right now. So yeah, Archers are a useful unit if you have, you know, the right stuff. Oh, there's a failure in here? Gosh darn it. I guess we're gonna... Oh, there's two failures! Damn! I, I wasn't expecting that. Enter. Okay, just end. I don't I don't care what he gets. Morona, we must banish this guy. 
Yeah, I, w I wasn't going to change my mind. I, I want the failure title. It's useful for a lot of work, so, you know, I'm going to take advantage of it. Like, you know, heavily. There's no reason for me not to, after all. Okay, that'll do for this episode. Next time, you know, we'll turn to Icicle Island and hopefully finish things up. Because I'm assuming there's a boss fight coming up there, hopefully. But maybe we're going to head to another island for even more training. We'll see. Till next time, then. See ya.